So we have time for questions, or we can go back and fill in some details. Billy? Yes. So um, when people come, they're coming to hire me. Right. How Now that you're not seeing clients, mm -hmm. how have you been able to transfer referral sources to work with other attorneys <coughs> in that initial consultation when they're expecting you? That's a great question. So he said, how do you, how do you hand off clients who come to hire you? This is, this, we spent a lot of time talking about this in our workshop um, because it's an issue. And the way that it works best is to think about other companies. In other companies, the salespeople do not do what it is that, whatever it is. Like if they're, if they're selling you a software, they're not implementing it. Um, and the way that they do it is confidently. So if you listen to your clients very carefully, and then you say to them, uh, you're gonna work with so-and-so. So-and-so is the best person to work on your case because blank, blank, blank. You have this, this, and this going on, and they're great at this, this, and this. If you were my sister, this is who I would have you work with within our firm. And they just do it. You set up a, you set up a handoff meeting, you bring the person in, and then as long as they're being well served, they won't have a problem. If they're either a problem client who's just hell-bent on being unhappy, then we get rid of them. Um, and we also make expectations really clear, like this is how it's going to be. If you're not happy with this, it's probably not going to work. And that usually works. 